Vials of hope, they're calling it, for Connecticut's most vulnerable residents right now. Another monumental step forward in the battle against COVID-19. Healthcare workers have been getting vaccinated all week, but today, nursing home residents rolled up their sleeves. Chief Capital reporter Susan Rav is live at the reservoir in West Hartford, where it all happened today. Good evening, Susan. Good evening, Irene. The reservoir is a nursing home here in West Hartford. They have about 75 beds. And as you mentioned, residents started getting their vaccines today. And that also includes staff. And this is just the first, the start of what could be something very hopeful. And many people are anxious to get their vaccines. And the hope is that it will not only prevent or help save lives, but prevent people from getting very sick. Nursing homes are now joining the fight to stop the spread of COVID. Staff and residents at the reservoir in West Hartford are among the very first people to be vaccinated. Jean Peters was ready for her COVID vaccine. Jean is 95 and to mark this historic occasion, she had her hair done and wanted to make sure her blue sweater matched her face mask. I feel fine, I feel good, the shot was no problem, and I think everyone that, that can and should get a shot of the virus, definitely, no matter what age. Starting today, all the residents and staff at this West Hartford nursing home will start getting a COVID vaccine. Connecticut is one of the very first states to have the vaccine available for folks in nursing homes, and right here at the reservoir is an appropriate place to be one of the leaders. The reservoir is owned by Genesis Healthcare. It has been rough. Our residents have suffered greatly, and our staff have felt the strain and the stress in caring for residents during this pandemic and also taking care of themselves and their families. It's a great step. Sophia Walker is a registered nurse. She was ready to roll up her sleeve and feels this is important for many reasons. Yes, because I know in, um, in terms of me being a, a minority, um, we don't want to take it because of previous the Tuskegee incident. So I know I'm setting a great example for the black community. CVS Health and Walgreens have been contracted by the federal government to give out these vaccines. CVS will be giving out the vaccines here at the reservoir. But it could be a tough sell for many people who have some concerns about the vaccine. We'll have more on that coming up on Eyewitness News at 6. Plus, how long could it take to vaccinate all of Connecticut's nursing home residents and staff? We are live in West Hartford, Susan Ralph, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.